has been just so nice here. We're getting lucky with this dry stretch of days that still continues until we hit about the middle parts of Thursday and uh, we're back under some showers. So plan for that. A nice start here in the gorge. This is out to the Dalles. You can see that sunrise so beautiful right now. Uh, again, not a cloud in the sky here, so we are seeing some lovely colors to kick off our morning out in the Dalles. 52 degrees in Portland and again, the airport there where we take these temperatures is one of the warmer spots of the morning here in the area. A lot of areas are more so in the mid 40s, so grab that that uh, heavier jacket out the door. It is a little chilly as we kick off this morning. We'll likely hover in the 40s, then the low 50s going into our later morning hours. Right now we are still dry as we kick off our morning, but I am watching the system offshore here. It's likely to shift towards the north and just miss our area. So we are still dry for today, but we'll likely see some clouds from the system kind of filtering back into the region. So a cloudier afternoon on the way here again. That closer look showing uh, we're still dry as we kick off our Tuesday and again we will likely stay dry. I do see chance that we maybe get a brief sprinkle for the north parts of the coast as that system nears. But again, not much rain out there today, not enough to really ruin any plans. So still a great day to get outside. Here's our future cast this weather model again keeps us cloudy. Those clouds again just pushing right on in as we head into our afternoon. So expect a fairly cloudy day today. We'll still see some warmer conditions again. This model still trying to push a sprinkle in Portland. I think we will stay dry as we head into our Wednesday. Those clouds start to push back out. We get some breaks in the clouds, so a partly sunny and warmer day on Wednesday. Tomorrow will likely be our warmest day of the week, possibly warmest day of the year as we hit the upper 70s. So plan to be outside tomorrow. It'll almost feel a little like summertime if we hit those upper 70s temperatures again, warming right up for tomorrow. Now Thursday is when we introduce some rain here, light showers and sprinkles first as we hit the evening time. Uh, then by the later evening and overnight, we'll start to see some heavier showers pushing in again. Thursday doesn't look too rainy, but we'll see chance for those light rain showers back in the picture here, still scattered about, uh, but that chance for rain again back in the picture Thursday through Friday. Friday also looks to be a day of very light. Light rain. I think we'll see some dry moments too. So of the days with rain this week, Thursday and Friday, it looks like we'll see some of the lighter stuff. Now Saturday looks to bring in a stronger weather system. You can see that offshore spinning around. This is going to bring in some heavier showers as we kick off our three day weekend Memorial Day weekend. So do plan to see some rain here heading into our weekend. Here's our rain chances again. We are dry through Wednesday, very isolated light showers both Thursday and Friday. I think the weekend will bring us some of that heavier stuff. So uh, keep that in your plans here. I still see some nice outdoor time Thursday and Friday, even though we do have that chance for rain both those days. Today we are in the upper 50s to low 60s for the coast. I think we could see a sprinkle for the north parts of the coast in the upper 60s, even near 70 today out to Salem down to Corvallis. Just a nice afternoon, even though we are a little cloudier, uh, but we'll see some mild highs today. Still pleasant to be outside in the upper 60s by this weekend. Showers back in the picture and we're back in the low 60s. Coming up.